Hey boy. Make him whistle like a missile. Bomb, bomb. Every time I show up, blow up. Um. Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a OG beauty guru video. I, I don't even know how to describe it, but it's going to be my oh, what's in my bag video because I've actually never done one of these before. I've done one for like a school bag, I'm pretty sure, but that's private. And so I thought I'd do one today because I recently received a really nice bag and I've been using it a lot and I've been loving it. And there's a lot of stuff and shiz. And I just wanted to sit down and do a really chill video with you guys. So the bag I'm currently carrying is the Teddy Blake New York Rachel bag. I'm pretty sure I looked it up so I have the right info for you guys. But this is the Rachel bag in gray leather. And this is completely Italian leather with suede on the side. Um, I have here the 12 inch one, which means it's 12 inches at the very bottom, the width of it. So it's the bigger size. When Teddy Blake uh, contacted me to pick out a bag from their site for me to try out for you guys, I picked this one because I just love the square shape of it and it's huge. I love huge bags. And this is actually really cool because you can unzip the two sides right here. It's a huge bag and I can definitely see myself using this for school if I end up not wanting to use a backpack or something. The leather feels super soft and it may look like or feel like it would scratch easily but I've been wearing this everywhere for the past three-ish weeks and I have quite long nails. They can get long and super sharp and there are no scratches on this whatsoever and I am pleasantly surprised because when I got this bag in it just felt like the leather felt so soft that it would scratch easily but it's so durable. I love it. I I'm in love with the quality but one downside I do have about this bag is the label right here it's supposed to say Teddy Blake New York but due to the heat I did email them about this um, due to the heat when I got this bag it just kind of smudged off during shipping and I was so sad when I got the bag in and it had a little smudge right here because you can't even like this the label of the bag is like almost off and I thought that was a really big downside but honestly I've been carrying it around it doesn't really matter anymore. I've seen the other bags on their Instagram and in other videos and they seem fine and plus fall time is coming up so I'm sure the heating won't be bad anymore to ruin the bag but anyway let's just hop into what I have inside. Here is the interior it's just there's a lot of stuff going on in here but let's just go into it. So in the front right here we have two little pockets and these are perfect for like um, gum or like a lip balm or something and that is what I always use these little pockets for. So right now I just have my soft lips lip balm in here but I also used to have some gum or breath strips. I just took those out for school there in my backpack. And then in the very back we have a empty pocket actually. It's unzipped and I usually keep my charger in there but I'm charging my phone right now actually. It's in here. But here's my charger and apparently keys. Okay so I have my keys so this just has a little Hello Kitty keychain, my name keychain, house keys, and a little keychain I got from Canada. Moving right along I have next my little makeup bag thing but it's not actually a makeup bag it's for my pads. Next up I have a pair of sunglasses and these are from Zaful I'm pretty sure. Yeah these are just my little gray reflective sunglasses. And then I have receipts of course this is unfiltered I haven't cleaned this bag out yet and then I have a little zippy bag of some Claritin and band-aids I'm pretty sure I carried this for my mom because I don't have allergies these are hers here's my breast strips so here yeah here they are they're my Listerine breast strips and I always have these with me like I need fresh breath um I have a lollipop this is from I don't know when but I always have like bits of food and candy in here so don't judge me. Next up I have two lip products. I honestly don't know why all my things are out of the pockets. These are supposed to be in the pocket with my lip balm. But anyway I have my NARS lipstick in Dolce Vita which is my favorite everyday lipstick. And then I have ColourPop Satin lip color in Echo Park which is another fave of mine. Next up I have my wallet and this is the Michael Kors wallet. It comes with a strap actually that you can wear but it's just my everyday wallet. I have cards and receipts in here. Then I have a little uh, hair clip thing to clip up my hair. It's just in here. And that's about it. That's all that's inside my bag. And honestly, that was a wreck. I really needed to throw some stuff out. What the heck? Um, but the inside, honestly, is so nice. It's probably my favorite part of the bag. It's a suede material, so it feels really nice. It's just really nice and roomy. You can fit so much stuff in here. And of course, we have the little buckle right here. It's just like a little magnetic 
button and it just closes so yeah there's no zip or anything it's just super simple to open up the bag to get your stuff so that is all that is in my current handbag thank you guys so much for watching this video once again i will link this bag down below for you guys because i love it so much like i've expressed throughout this whole entire video. And also, I do have a coupon code for you guys for $20 off your handbag or purchase. Um, the coupon code will be right here and down below for you guys as well. But yeah, that is all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And uh, um, yeah, I will, yeah, no, mm, I will see you guys in my next video. So, bye beauties! Uh, uh. To me, it's a good hajj, my god, I got